Well, good morning, everyone. And I think it's Thursday. Let me look. Thursday, yes. Happy, happy Thursday. Hope your day's going well. Um, you're probably wondering what the heck's going on because uh, the camera view is a little bit different. And that's because I, I got a new camera. It's a better camera. And it was a lot cheaper. It was a steal. So that's one of my steals for today. And as you see, I'm in no shape right now yet to uh, start reading. Because I've got this whole mess here to deal with now. You couldn't see it before. <laughs> but I did need to change the cloth and everything. So I'm going to do that now. And uh, fast forward. Okay, I'm afraid of these candles staining this light cloth. So there we go. I've got these old, like, kind of candle holders. And there they go. So that didn't take too long. I guess we will have time for uh, some reading. Okay. On that steel with the camera, it also came with this little tripod. I don't know if this, I guess that's as far out as it goes, but that's so cool. If I ever needed to move it to another location, something else. For my crystals, this looks oranger than what it does. This is red jasper. Red jasper is a crystal of endurance and vibrancy, a promoter of justice, life, and protection, and warrior's amulet. The stone halted the blood of wounds, increased fertility, and stirred the pulse. It was used by the Germanics and Vikings uh, in order to infuse courage, and the Egyptians associated the stone with Mother Isis's fertilizing blood and usually carved it into an amulet to be worn upon the neck of a deceased. Hmm. That sounds unusual. Blood, neck, almost sounds a little vampiric there. Um, this stone can get rid of uh, negativities returning to them. Uh... It's a worry stone that can soothe the nerves and restore balance. It's perfect for clearing your mind during contemplation, meditation, and prayer. Uh, the high spiritual energies of red jasper will boost endurance and focus during a long ceremony and practice. It is also valuable when it comes to establishing a new spiritual discipline. It is also an excellent stone for astral travel and shamanic journeying and will offer vivid dream recall. And it will also stimulate passion in your creative work, allowing you to 
manifests new and fresh ideas and it brings self-mastery and focus. It's associated with the lower chakra, which is why it is holding strong protective properties. It will help you uh, feel grounded in today's world. Moreover, the stone comes with uncanny capabilities in, o in order to stir up your life force by shaking sluggish energies from all your energy points. Now, this one stone is said to be beneficial for people who need additional support during hospitalization, prolonged illness, or injury. Because of its capacity to help generate muscle tissues, this stone may be beneficial in bodybuilding and weightlifting. It even improves the effect of ex exercise. On the other hand, it is thought to improve one's circulatory system, removing the bile ducts and liver blockages. It even detoxifies the blood. It will fortify the heart and improve circulation. It may also be valuable in treating heart conditions, anemia, and exhaustion. But remember, I am no doctor. I am just uh, reading this and passing it on to you all. I recommend going to see a doctor foremost before you even consider anything else. That being said, let me continue. It's also used in increasing fertility and sex drive, um, especially if uh, the wearer undergoes concept treatment. Uh, it's thought to help stabilize pregnancies and promote sturdy fetal growth, and it facilitates and safe childbirth. Red Jasper can bring strength in order to defy emotional denomination by other people and the bravery to surpass domestic violence. This stone will also sustain those who are in the process of recovering from sexual experiences and violence. On the other hand, it's perfect for children being bullied and teased at school. It's a tangible and bright reminder and a good builder of confidence. If you feel spiritually defunct, apathetic, or unemotional, red jasper can reactivate a living passion. It is also typically used to spark creative and sexual energies. It will assist you in identifying your personal beliefs and ideas about sexual orientation and expression. It will also help in relieving guilt and shame around such problems. Moreover, Red Jasper will help in maintain emotional stability and balance during difficult times. For instance, remission during prolonged treatment and severe illness in which the results are uncertain. There's so many things for protection, for insomnia, for anxiety, for career success, for empaths. And then you combine them with other things and you can have other um possibilities but there you have it that's red jasper for you i'm hoping you're seeing this a little bit better than before the camera is supposed to be a, a better one and i'm hoping it'll focus better and show up better than the, the previous one did now Okay, this, this deck is a steel, it's the Edgar Allan Poe Tarot, the Poe Tarot, and it's a brand new deck, so I need to mix them up and break them in a bit and shuffle them. Okay, and let's see what card we got. You have the page of pentacles our page of pentacles is von kemplin 
as he made this miraculous discovery. The suit's page is about discovery and in integration. Poe wrote this story to discourage people from traveling to California in search of gold during the gold rush in 1848 to 1855. Poe believed that only fools made the long trek to California in an attempt to get rich quick. Strictly speaking, this story was a hoax. Poe's point was simple in economics. If everyone who traveled to California discovered gold, no one would be rich. The value of gold would plummet. In this image, von Kemplin stands in front of the chemist apparatus. A small furnace burns in the corner. In his right hand, he holds a crucible filled with lead. In his left is a gold scarab beetle that he forged from lead. Now expect good news regarding real estate. If you're headed back to school, you may get approved for financial aid. Money will flow much easier to you now. You may increase your skills by taking classes. Doing so establishes a sturdier foundation upon which you can achieve your goals. Academic achievement is indicated as you're responsible and dependable. You may plan a business launch or negotiate salary for a job. These activities should lead in your favor. Your health promises to be strong and stable. Relationships will tend to be on the serious side, a positive sign for marriage. Your partner is stable, loyal, responsible, and committed. And the key words for this is financial opportunities, business opportunities, motivation, ambition, academics, commitment, and manifestation. Now the element is earth. The key meaning is uh, talent shines and money news. This page reveals progress and adventure as well as auspicious beginnings. This is a time to nurture your skills and abilities. There will be good news concerning finances, business, education, and travel. The Page of Pentacles also highlights the need for management, and in work matters, there may be an opportunity to manage people and projects. This page often appears to show a job offer or an offer made on a property. The card does come with an element of caution, however. There is a real need for attention to detail now and for diligence in all practical affairs. So double check all arrangements and agreements. Also check through your personal schedule to ensure everything you plan is realistic. The page of pentacles can also be a sign that it's time to attend to finances. He comes up in reading to nudge us to do our taxes and renew outstanding insurance policies. As a person, hardworking and methodical, reliable and dedicated, this page is practical and trustworthy. As a page, he is a younger person or someone with youthful vigor. He may be starting out in the world or in a new line of business. He may not have money now, but he has the potential to achieve great things in the future. So you can believe in him and his plans. He will succeed and he will not give up. This card can also show a young person's achievement and reward for his or her efforts in sport or education. Now, as a U card in a reading, it means money and opportunities beckon. You have the opportunity to establish a new venture. Now, let me read a side card with that. And these cards I am choosing is from the Enchanted Map. And they were steel. So once again, I've got to uh, mix these cards up good. Okay, you have strength. Your true strength comes not from self-reliance alone, but from a sincere faith in a higher power. 
The strength to accomplish even the most daunting tasks is yours at this time. You can connect with and channel the power of the universe. The strength card indicates that your ideas are being tested, redefined, and your relationships are being deepened. No matter what happens, nothing can move you off the course of evolution. As the potency of your connections becomes more obvious, you're able to harness the creative energies that, you're available, that are available to you. Have courage and dive in, for magic is in the process of finding a form to take. When you remember that real strength comes from a combination of your efforts and reliance on a higher power working through you, all is possible. You can do anything now. All right, I like that. Nice, upbeat, positive message. I love the way that ended. So there, there it goes. Okay, let me show you a few more. Uh, steals and deals I've gotten. Okay. I thought this was really cool. It's, let me take it out of this package. It's for, it's for use with a pendulum. And since I have a pendulum and I've never used it in that way before, I thought, who knows, maybe sometime, maybe do a live stream or something. And uh, what else? Okay, I... Uh, for some reason, they sent me a, a sand dollar. I haven't had one of those in ages. And I got this dragon egg with the eyeball. I thought it was complete full round egg, but and they just gave me a half. But oh well, it's kind of cool, creepy. And what else? Uh, they sent me. I guess it's soap. <laughs> it's a heart-shaped thing of soap. I didn't order it. I don't know where this came from. Anyway, I'll uh, I'll go ahead and end now. I got more stuff coming on the way for steals and deals. Some of it's here already, but I don't want to show everything all at one time. So. Peace. Believe. Hope you have a blessed uh, Thursday. I said it was. Yeah, hope you have a blessed Thursday. Um, until tomorrow, take care. Bye-bye.